What's going on guys? Kyle here, Jailbreak Central, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to jailbreak iOS 6. This is the newest jailbreak. It'll jailbreak your iPhone 5, your iPad, iPod Touch, all the newest devices on the newest form firmware, iOS 6.0, 6.0.1, 6.0.2, any the newest firmware. Apple has not released a firmware that isn't jailbreakable by this um, jailbreak. So this will jailbreak all your devices, the iPhone 5, which we've always wanted to do. It's been, um, we've been waiting a long time for this, and it is finally out, and it is called Evasion. So I'm going to be basically taking you guys through the steps on downloading this application on your computer, and then going ahead and jailbreaking your device. So first off, go ahead into Google or whatever search browser you want to use and type in the word Evasion. And now it should come up. It is Evasion.com with an, a zero instead of an O in Evasion. And just go ahead and click on that, and it'll say Evasion iOS 6.x, which stands for 6. Point whatever, um, jailbreak. Now you go ahead and just click on whatever um, computer you're running, Linux, uh, Mac OS X, Windows, whatever that, and it'll basically download it right there. Then you just click on it, open it up, and you should get something that looks like this. This is called Evasion version 1.0. So now I'm going to be showing you guys basically through the steps, and what it says here is connect your iPhone, iPod Touch, or iPad, and I'm going to go ahead and do that right now. So just plug your device, and you can see I am using the iPhone 5. There's the new dock connector there. This is the iOS 6.1 on the iPhone 5 and once you've plugged in the computer go ahead and go back to the evasion screen And it'll prompt you with a brand new step Okay, so now that you have your device plugged in you'll see here It'll say it they recognize my device It says iPhone 5 GSM iOS 6.1 and it says it is supported make sure it says it is supported and it says click the jailbreak button to begin Now you just see there I click the jailbreak button and it'll start doing a bunch of different stuff uploading Cydia um, All that stuff it takes a very long time actually this is probably one of the longest jailbreaks um, compared to Red Snow or Green Poison or any of those jailbreak tools. It's probably one of the longest, but it is the only one out right now that can jailbreak untethered for the iPhone 5 um, and the new iPod Touch and iPad. So it does take a little long, but um, just bear with me, and I'll see you guys in a bit once it's done. Okay, so it's not done yet, but it does have a couple steps that I want to walk you guys through. Um, so it does say right in the beginning, it'll say waiting for the device to reboot, and it says do not touch your device. Now your device should start rebooting soon, and it'll come up with the Apple logo. It's all the normal reboot, as you'll see here. Right here, you can see my phone is rebooting normally, just like that. But once it reboots, do not touch it. you got to make sure you don't touch it during when it says to, because you could possibly screw up your device. Okay, so you can see here that my phone is done rebooting. However, it's in the normal lock screen. However, don't touch it because on the screen, it still says do not touch the device. It just says um, injecting stage two jailbreak data. So even though your device is back up and running, do not touch it, don't unlock it, don't do any of that stuff. Otherwise you could mess up the jailbreak and it could screw up your phone. By the way, make sure you have a backup of this before just to make sure it's, um, it's all good. So other than that, I'll see you guys once this part is done. So now that it's done all that, you can see here the next prompt is it'll say unlock your device and tap the new jailbreak icon, only tap it once. I cannot stress that enough, if you tap it twice, it'll mess it up. And you see here I unlock my phone and go it is, there it is, that's the jailbreak, if I just um, focus it there, that's the jailbreak icon, you tap it, your screen will flash really quickly, and then go back to the normal home screen as you can see there, do not tap it again. Once you tap it and your screen flashes and goes back to the home screen, it's very quick, It'll come back to this, it'll say injecting remount payload, and that's the very last step of the jailbreak. Once it's done that, you'll see here in a second it comes up with a prompt that basically says it's done, and you can ex exit um, this. Here you can see there it is. You just click exit, and it'll exit the evasion process. It's basically done. Then all you have left to do is wait for your phone to finish doing it. Basically, it'll run some tests, upload Cydia, make sure everything's working properly, um, and stuff like that. You'll see it also may reboot a couple times, when I mean a couple, it could be two or three, it could be one, it doesn't really matter, but wait, you'll see there, that evasion icon will come up, but definitely wait until it says it's all done and your lock screen is done rebooting, otherwise, once again, as I said before, it could screw up your device. Okay, so once you are completely sure that it's done rebooting, there's no evasion icon, it's all good, you can go ahead and unlock your device, and as you can see there, there is the Cydia application that we've all been waiting for. This is on the iPhone 5 6.1. This jailbreak works once again for iPhone 5, iPod Touch 5G, iPad, all the new devices, and it works on version 6.1, 6.0.1, and 6.0.2. Basically, it works on anything 6 point and above. So unfortunately it doesn't work for anything lower, but there are websites and videos on my channel that you can check out 
Once you've jailbroken it, I definitely recommend looking at a lot of my videos that I show you some of the best tweaks and themes to download from Cydia. But that's it. That is how you jailbreak the iPhone 5 here. You see it's just preparing the file system. Other than that, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you guys have a great day. And as always, see you guys later.